their mom's April. It's always April Fool's Day. Is this Evie's first temple? Yeah. Oh man, look at that line. This is like Disneyland, guys. We have filled up the whole sink with bubbles. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, good morning guys. Just got back from my run and did 10 miles today. So whenever I go on these long runs, I, I usually get like this one lingering thought that I kind of ponder on, not really by choice, just kind of what happens when I'm running. Uh, today's thought was, so when people get really old, I mean, I know this is a generalization, but usually they're like really, um, really ornery and mean and bitter or like really nice, and like almost like Jesus, like so nice and loving to everybody. And and I, and I shared a quote the other day that was like, um, it doesn't matter how big your steps are, but it matters that you're going, only that you're going in the right direction. So on that note, if, and then when I share this stuff, it's for, it's mostly for me. This is stuff I'm working on, um, but you guys can work on it too, if you need to, but, um, I noticed the the longer you go in life, like the more people like start to bug you. And hey, Daisy, good morning. good morning. The more people like start to bug you, and you can. And each little interaction is is the steps you're heading in a certain direction, either of turning into the old grumpy, bitter old person, or the really nice, Christ-like person. So as long as you're are aware and conscious of the direction you're headed then you can then you can start to adjust your course and be the person that you want to be and be that super nice person that everybody likes to be around so that's me that's what I'm working on adjusting my steps and my actions and the way I talk about people and interact with people every day so that I can be that nice Christ-like loving old person when I'm older so that's it and all right, on with the day. What did Daisy do to you this morning? She didn't cook the middle of a pancake and she made me eat it, but then I threw a burnt pancake on her. A burnt pancake? A burning Burning pancake. hot pancake. Okay, April Fool's Day's over. Uh, uh, but since her mom's April, it's always April Fool's Day. Oh. Uh. So we are at the open house of the Jordan River Temple. This is a, not a new temple. They renovated it. And so now, before they dedicate it, it's open to the public for everybody to go inside and see all the rooms of the temple. So we always try to come to these, show the kids what's inside the temple. So the, everybody's welcome to do it. If you ever get the chance to go to an LDS temple, uh, open house, take it. So I don't think I can film in there, but there's pictures of everything online, but this should be fun. You ready for this? Is this Evie's first temple? Is this your first temple? Oh, first yeah. Ender. Oh, Ender, you're looking snazzy, bro. I haven't even seen Evie. that outfit yet. Oh, look at that. Good shortcut, Ender. Yep. Shot many a wedding videos right there on that chair. One of the few pretty spots. This temple. Right, Ender? Yeah. Oh, man, look at that line. This is like Disneyland, guys. All right, Grandma made it, and Evie's making her way with the candy. Oh, Evie. We're making some progress in line. We're getting there. Oh, stroller, get away. All right, here we go. So apparently this sweater is so ugly that she would rather freeze to death than wear it. Evie, just wear it. <laughs> just put it on. Just wear it. We got a bit of a situation here. The ponytail's getting ripped out. Evie's oh. done. Evie is done. That was a well, tight one. Put the elastic back in. Oh, are you done before we even started, Evie? Huh? Uh. Well, the right. Was that awesome? Yeah. That was so beautiful inside. I wore the wrong shoes, so I'm in pain. We were uh, here for a couple hours. And my feet hurt, but I'm so glad we came, even though it was a long wait, because the temple is beautiful. And I wish I kind of saw some befores and afters. Maybe they'll show them in here. So I want to see how different it looks. I really loved the temple. Seven more, isn't that amazing? But the bad the thing about it is me. that I am exhausted. That's and Grandpa is uh, currently behind me. Oh, excuse me, excuse me, my bad. <laughs> there's a bigger word for exhausted, I'd say. This is... Ugh. 
April almost made it with the shoes. Oh, almost so made it. Beauty before comfort, always. What? Always. Well, two hours of walking. Ender, up. hey, what'd you think of the temple? Well, Was it beautiful? Cool. Pretty cool, right? You double fist in it. You got sucker and ice cream. We are making a bubble mania with our bubble guns. We have filled up the whole sink with bubbles. Oh my gosh. Except for one corner. <gasps> yeah, that one corner just won't fill up. Wait, it fell up! I fell it up. No way. No way. Oh, so anyways, ending the vlog now. Um, I changed the oil on both the motorcycles. Tomorrow, we are off for spring break. And hopefully, the plan is we're gonna bring the side-by-side -side and two motorcycles on the trailer if I can figure out how to safely strap them all down securely. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah, so that is it. Thank you so much for watching the vlog today. We appreciate you guys, we love you. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Let's go have some fun.